Okay, guys. So I'm going to go on a bit of a tangent here. Uh, if you who did follow up on the last check-in, you've been informed that I'm fighting a lot uh, involving my disorder. And I just want to give you the update that they possibly won't be covering my medicine. Now, I'm not going to get all worked up and yell at the camera like most YouTube musicians do. I guess we're not talking to our auditions or what? Auditions? What the fuck am I talking about? Audiences. Audiences. My bad. And um, I just want to say, what the fuck are you doing? Okay, so let me try to break down my disorder for people who don't know it, all right? This is for the people who completely don't even know what my disorder is. I have maple syrup urine disease, and that is a protein deficiency. Something I was born with. I didn't contract it. I didn't get it. And I didn't grow it later in the years. It didn't come out of nowhere. It, there's no way it could hop out of my system out of nowhere. Nothing. What angers me is when they think that I don't need the necessities to care for that. I have to take medicine every day. And this medicine helps me breathe. It builds amino acids. It keeps me alive. You know, something I really can't live without unless if I just take a goddamn knife to my liver and rip it out and grab some homeless man's liver and shove it in myself. But you know how that's going to work. That's not possible. That scenario is not possible without the team, you know. Uh, so where does my rant begin with this? One, social services, fuck you, okay? i always been against the system. That's like my punk route. But right now, at the moment, I'm bringing you fucking down all right i don't care and i'm not going to do it like this guy. i'm not going to go ahead and break crimes and cause anarchy i am going to financially hurt you guys uh you take away my medicines that uh keep me alive and keep me cherishing my every breath and want me to leave this goddamn room every day i will take you down and i'll make sure your wife leaves you right after it i will bring this to court if i have to they plan on taking my medicine and they do not plan on covering it Okay, so let me get this straight. You won't cover a, a kid's medicine that he needs to stay alive that he didn't really ask for. But, oh, you'll cover people, uh, various pills when they're in psych wards because you think it's okay. Uh, you'll give people Narcan because apparently overdoses are more important than metabolic disorders. No. One, you all got the system fucked up. It's all sorts of fucked up. And I don't care who I offend by saying this. This is dead-ass truth. They don't give a fuck about you guys. Social services. Fucking, uh, you know, the people who run the medicine shit. You know, the people who run uh, your disability checks. The people who run everything. Everything that goes around. You're just a number. Okay, you're just a number. But you fucking listen here. I am not a number. You're going to remember my name. And you're going to remember my case. And when I win this... And when I look back on this video and laugh that I ran it over nothing, then okay. Because I'm going to win. You're all going to lose. You seriously think that you can take away my medicine and kill me off? You guys have just dug yourself the biggest sinkhole you dug in a while. And that's a, that's a whole track record. Because these last three years, the government hasn't been doing it right, right? <laughs> and I'm not going to blame that on the right side or the left side. I'm not political. Fuck politics. I just think... The government in general is stupid as shit. Uh, but the thing is, uh, when it comes to taking my shit away for no reason, I will drag you to court. I will call the senator. I will write the board members of the state. And I will raise tooth nail hellfire on you guys, all right? This ain't done yet. And for people in a similar situation who has like a sickness in the government kind of twiddles and fucks with you around too this one's for you i'm not only doing this fight for me i am literally sticking up for sick people that don't get the treatment that they deserve and it's unbelievable my friend who's a really good friend of mine by the way he went to a mental hospital and they give him over five medications that he did not need and he and his family agreed that he did not need but some fucking pouches that have to drink every day just so I can stay alive. Uh, apparently, they ain't gonna give me unless they feed it through a tube. Uh, well, I won't have a chance to be eating it through a tube because if you don't give me it, then I die. Okay, so I want you all people, you know, you suit, necktie, three meal eating, full family functioning, having asses.
So really think about what you're doing to yourself because you are sinking yourself. Someone's either going to get fired, sued, or they're going to get scalded, which they already have. My medical team is raising hell over this. I am not going to lose. I am not going to back down. You privileged fucks are in for a ride. At the end, the sick is the strong and the hit and the healthy is the weak. We'll see how hard you'll be laughing when I win. A little fucking my drink.